Hi everyone, welcome back to Dark Souls. We're gonna go and fight another boss. Cause this is boss, boss, boss central. First we have Quaylag and then you go to Cecil and then you gotta deal with the mini bosses of the big bosses that you've previously defeated in the game. And then you have more bosses. And then there's the boss of, which is the triplet of Asylum and Stray. And now you have a giant centipede, which is great. You can summon to level this, but we did one with him and I felt bad. He got beaten up and eaten. So we'll let him have a bit of a break while I try and figure out how the heck to manage this creature. I really don't like it. It's very icky. And that might be because I just don't like bugs really. So I don't know what's like bug like. Except bugs life, which is a great film. Freaks me out a bit. Okay, I wonder if I can get him like a bit further here. Cause he seems to be there but he also goes for the big punch well lunge lunge punch come here oh yes no why why go go away get a job something go learn to do something else with your time that's not annoying me Run, 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 I hate this boss with so much passion. Like, what the heck is that? That's not even an attack. That's just annoyance. I can't even see anything. I'm just... Just go, 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 go. Where are we going? Ah, get up. I'm so done with this boss. So dumb of you! Go away! Wait. Ooh. Okay! <laughs> I generally thought today's episode was just going to be me going back and forth for a bit, which is why I didn't do a proper introduction. Because... That was my fourth or fifth time fighting him. And the first couple of times I didn't even get many hits in. I'm so confused. But I got a ring. Okay, what, what have I got? I've got a ring of favor and I got the ring. Evil eye. Lava damage, yes. All the other stuff I have. Extra magic. I don't have magic. Traverse Abyss? What's the Abyss? Answer so like Venus summonings. Don't have that. We can't remove Ring of Favor. Let's put that one on. Because I feel like that's probably going to be sensible right now. So wait, can we now walk on the lava? Well, I'll burn off eat more. Oh, yes. Mmm. The beautiful. Oh, we are losing a bit of health. Okay. <laughs> Don't get too cocky. Okay, so where do I go? I'm so confused. I'm still like, I'm still battling the centipede. I was just complaining about it. Okay. What's this? Is this like a hidden wall thing? Can I just hit you instead? No, okay, so where do I go? Where do I go? Is it like... Is there something here? Was... Wait a minute, where do I go? I'm so confused. I don't like it when I'm confused. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, wait, did I come from here or there? Why not go through there? They make it look like... Oh. I think I'm just thrown because I didn't think I was going to be the boss. And now I'm like, oh, I've got to actually do stuff in the game. Bloody hell. <gasps> Slayer, bird, how you doing? I got him. Do not worry. I avenged Why? you. Why? Why? After all this searching, I still cannot find it. What are you looking for? 
why? Why? After all this searching, I still cannot find it. Um, what are you looking for? Is he lost something? Or is this the sun? Because I don't think you'll find it down here, mate. Very unlikely. Very unlikely. Given, you know, the whole, like, it's dark down here. Oh, I wonder if I get... See, I know Solar has a big quest sign, but I feel like, because I wasn't aware of that when I first started Dark Souls. So when I first met Solar, I was still a bit, like, very newbie. I'm now like, oh, I think I've probably missed some, like, really big things here. But it just makes me, like, more excitement to be, like, go back and play this game again and, like, understand more and more each time. But, yeah. But, I like Solar. He's a good boy. I talk to him as if he's a dog, which I'm really sorry, because that's probably really rude of me. Will I have enough? Oh, I can't remember if a proud knight gives me enough or not. I was thinking I might have enough souls. No. How much do I need to, like, level up? It's going to be a lot, isn't it? 34. So I need 3, 4, 7,000 souls. Then I can do my endurance up again. Okay. Slay, are you sure you're okay? Tears. Why? It's still why? why. That's okay. After it can be why. It's okay, Slay. I don't really understand this quest line. I'll probably have to watch some lore videos when I finish my playthrough. Because I don't want to potentially spoil anything, but... Yeah. I am intrigued to know more about like the side characters like Seatmund and... I'm trying to think of the name more. Framped Brachiosaurus. No, like, if there's actually a story to him. Yeah. Oh, and these are the other routes to the Great Hollow that have, like, been warped by lava. Where's the lava coming from now, though? If, um, Cecil's gone. Lost Isolith. Lost Isolith. That sounds familiar. That. Oh, is this? Oh, is this like where another soul's gonna be? Like, um, like a lord vessel? No, we've got a lord vessel. Um, it's gonna be safe. What's the thing I've got? What like? Uh, that yeah, a lord soul, soul shard. This where like another one's gonna be because the start you've got pygmy and then mentioned thief naito and then there was the rags pet person who wears what i wear because they stole my fashion sense so yeah oh we must be coming close to another soul oh okay i thought that would take a while also i'm just gonna see is that gonna bring me up enough this is so risky what I'm doing. Five. Oh, I need just more. Oh, shit. There we are. Oh, wait a minute. Let's see. Oh, shit. These are like... What are these? Where do I go? Is that a route I can jump on? Paths here are not very uh, clear. They're a bit chardish. Make it a little hard to know exactly like if you're on the right track for anything. Oh god, I'm just gonna run forward. I can't stay here for long. Oh, brave warrior soul. That's what I wanted. So if I can go back somehow. Yeah, can this take me back to the bonfire so I can just level up now and then if I die, I'm fine. I'm accepting of my fate. Because I, like, I don't know, just having this amount of souls and yes, I put myself in this predicament by consuming all the souls. But when you're this close to a level and every level does make a little bit of a difference, I want to just, you know, 
not risk losing it when I'm this close. So we'll do like a wee level up. Wee level up. And then if I just leave, if I lose like the leftover souls, that's fine because it's not that big of a deal. Just a big deal when you've got enough souls to level up. I'm just rambling. Ramble, ramble, ramble. All the rambles. Hey, Salem, I'm back. You miss me? I missed you. If I, oh, wait a minute. Slur? Oh, he's gone. Slur? Come back. What do I do? I'm going to do endurance. I want to get them both to 35, so it doesn't really matter. But yeah, where's Slur? Just left. He's gone. Disappeared. Poor Slayer. I hope he finds what he's looking for. I hope Slayer has like a nice ending, but this feels like Dark Souls doesn't feel like there is going to be a nice ending regardless. Feels like it's probably going to be one of those morally bleak and. Well, this is the world we're in and it's shit, but this is like the best that you can have for yourself. But if you're like interested in being like a massive hero and saving the world, then you're definitely gonna lose. That's what Dark Souls feels like for me. It's that game. And maybe that's why I enjoy it, because you don't have to worry about like consequences to others in this game or even yourself, because it's like the world's a bit dark and bleak anyway. It's gonna be dark and bleak regardless. So you just gotta learn to be like this is the world we live in. Which, you know, doesn't really sound that cheerful and I don't know why I enjoy a game so much what's like this, but maybe it's because it takes the pressure off. And this is going to be when someone puts in the comments when they see this video and like, what do you mean? Like, Dark Souls has got like a really good moral story to it and it is like about fighting good versus evil and like, there's actually a really happy ending and then you end up attending like Soler's reunification with his son. Um, like, there's going to be, like, a whole, like, law. And I will have missed it. What are these things? They're just ignoring me. Oh, no, not you. What? What's this? Nope. Just a wall. That's just a wall. <gasps> no wall. Okay. What are you? Are you a... Okay, you are not a mimic. I'm just starting to hit everything now. Soul of a great hero. Excellent. If anything looks like a wall, what could easily be smashed, probably is. That's what Dark Souls has taught me. Um, that sounds big. Oh, that sounds big. No, no, I don't want to be. I don't know what you are, giant thingy. You killed something for us though, so thank you. I mean, a pet, not a friend, a pet. My pet wants to eat me, but, you know. It's fine. It's just teething and training issues. Eventually, it'll learn to stop wanting to eat me. What are yous? You're like... You look like the dragons of Power Train Your Dragons mixed with a piranha. To be quite honest. Piranha dragons. Oh, twin humanities. Nice. Right, where are we even going? There's a bit down here. Do I just go here? Can I just... Can't really... I just don't even really know where to go. Try... Oh! Ah! Okay. I mean, I'm sort of right with the other one, what just turned out not to be a wall, so... Yeah, Dark Souls, you learn its secrets as you go because once you get like a couple of fake walls, like when we got the one um, in the Great Hollow, and that was like a double fake wall as well. And I thought it was a fake wall and then a mimic, but it turned out to be two fake walls. And the one was near the forest as well. Like you just start questioning everything what looks like a wall. You're like, are you a wall or not? But yeah, we might as well use our twin humanities. 
do some kindling. Because I feel like if they've given us twin humanities, normally when we get twin humanities, they want you to use the twin humanities because you're going to come up against something and you're going to need it. So I think I need to have at least 10 Estus. I pressed the wrong button again. <laughs> it's weird because it's, it's, everything else is A, but when it comes to the selections, I always have to press B and I don't know why. I have went through and tried to change it and it doesn't let me, so there we are. Oh, look at our beautiful feet. And charred. And harmed. Okay, let's see if I can figure out where I'm going to be going. Like, where, where's a branch what looks like really thick? Or thick enough, like, to take me somewhere? That one does. A little. Okay, we've got to be, like, stealthy. F stealth, it's gone. Uh. Run! Run! Oh, Christ. Oh, no, I've been here before. Have I? Have I not? Excuse me, why does this whole place look the same? Tell me why. Tell me why. Okay, let's go back up there. Maybe if we have, like, height, that'll, uh, Give us a hand. Just thing is, on my screen, it all looks like... Oh. It's weird, because I have two of the exact same monitor. But on this monitor, for some reason, it doesn't like show me everything while I look at my OBS screen capture. It shows me stuff. Okay. Anything what looks like a stepping path. Anywhere I should be going. Let's have a look at this one. They say you should just swap everything over and give up on this monitor. Where do I go? That looks like a path, but I don't know how I get away. Just run through, I guess. Maybe it is just run through. Can I? Maybe it's just soften my fall. Okay. Yeah, let's just try this bit. My feet are on fire. Oh, I was right. Okay. I have no time to read messages. I have time to make mistakes with my life. But hey, we're doing something. We are doing it. was like quite nice and gentle wasn't it can i go this way no okay so definitely this way definitely this way okay we've got like a little poop down there saying this way any like goodies no it's just completely blocked okay new area we know the rules Stealth, stealth, and stealth. Oh, shit. Destroy. Oh, wait a minute. Ah! You tricked me. You camouflage shit. They literally are the camouflage shit. This, uh, no. now oh can i not oh, no oh i was gonna be like don't tell me i can't get up there oh, i hate this i 
I see you. I see you, you shit. Don't know why I'm double attacking you now. I can literally one shot you. Oh! Okay, got you before you burped. <laughs> How do I get up there though? How do I get up there? Right through the heart. What a way to go. Club through the heart. Okay. Just gonna go slowly. Slow and so and slow. Oh, you are real. Oh, yeah. At least I can defeat them with like one hit. I mean, before it wasn't like it was a mass. It took me ages anyway, but before it was like two hits, and now I can do it in one and be like hardcore. Oh, was that free? Dagger? Oh, I got three and one. Nice. Okay, something here. Hello. Anyone here? New areas are scary. This this area not hasn't been so much, but it could become so. Oh, remember my health. There'll always be something bigger and badder coming our way. Hello? Is anyone here? Hello? Ooh! Brave warrior sword. A very large one as well. Thank you. Okay, it's one up there. So I guess we're just coming out. What's, what are them floating things though? Oh my god, roots. Roots are the greatest enemy in this game. Colours. So pretty. Oh my god, what the fuck are you? What the heck are you? It's like a giant flea thing. Oh, die. Thank you. You are a bit freaky. So, wait a minute, I don't get it. Oh, okay, I do get it. So, can I go this way? No. Can I go this way? Oh, I don't trust any wall. <laughs> this is me just showing how sus I am with everything. Oh, you're hopping. Hop, hop, hop the way. Hop, hop, hop the way. Dun, dun. So I can go that way or this way. I'm gonna go this way for now. Because I can probably come back. Yes. Knew it. Hit. Oh, I feel like this is like a nice little farm area. I'm saying this and this is gonna be like a massive boss, but it's gonna like take me like 20 hours to defeat. Never saw the and everyone's just going to be like Nelson from The Simpsons going, ha ha, in the comments. Which, to be fair. <laughs> I didn't want it anyway. <laughs> I didn't want that anyway. What are you talking about? That, that, that was intentional. That was to tease you all missing that one very deliberately. Yes. Yeah, that's that's what it was. <laughs> we just gotta go. Keep on going, yeah. What the heck's this? I mean I didn't come here before. Did I? Okay, I guess I'm we'll go this way. Let's just go. Oh, okay, let's not go. Just in case there was something that way. I would love to talk to the designers and be like, what, what, what made you think stone ship was fearsome? Like, what was it that made you go, yeah, this will terrify people? This is what people want from their Dark Souls. <laughs> Because some of the designs of some of the creatures, I'm like, whoa. And then some of them, I'm just like, yeah. 
Looks like a stone piece of shit. Ah, oh, not you. Hi, Nemi. Can I just like whack it back? Imagine. Oh shit, get off! Okay. Well, we had some music of yesterday's episode at least. Um, guess we're gonna have to go and get them souls back and uh, fight a Tainite demon or just ignore it. We could do that, maybe, and then it turns out we actually have to face it. But I think ignoring it for the time being is the best way. But uh, yeah, thanks all for hanging out today. Please feel free to like, comment, or subscribe, and I'll uh, I'll see you next time. Remember, don't go hollow. Bye.